What's going on, Clutch Squad? It's your boy Dub here. It's your boy Ross. And we're in the Clutch. Hey. Back to y'all with another video, man. Super Bowl 59 being performed in New Orleans. Mm -hmm. Not by Lil Wayne. Yeah. Apparently, uh, that's crazy. They announced that uh, Kendrick Lamar would be doing the halftime performance this year, mm -hmm. and there was a lot of people that were, you know, you know, excited about it. Like, oh, Kendrick Lamar, we're gonna get the not like us you know, on a oh, bigger man. platform. But then there was a lot of people that felt like, well, the Super Bowl is in New Orleans, and Lil Wayne, arguably one of the greatest rappers of all time, it would have been dope for him to be a part of that. But I think we also said that. So once we found out it was gonna be in Louisiana again, we was like, bro, there's only one person that you gonna have performing at the at the concert. I mean, yeah, for, yeah. The, for the halftime, right? Yeah, yeah, That's yeah. kind of what we was, it was like a no-brainer almost. Mm -hmm. They are reporting that Kendrick Lamar is supposed to be the one performing. We'll go ahead and roll a clip of what it, the, the I guess the promo visual from his Instagram. Mm -hmm. What the deal, everybody? My name Kendrick Lamar, and I'll be performing at Super Bowl 59. Will you be pulling up? I hope so. You know there's only one opportunity to win a championship. No round twos. Let's get it. Boom! <laughs> so, yeah, that's him. And I heard the little jab there. If you yeah. heard it. No round twos. No round twos. Can only win the championship on the first round. Yeah. So, first time going. So. Yeah, we, we, we figured there was going to be some jabs there. Um, Ooh, obviously, we'll see if... <laughs> Drake drops another gigabytes, another hundred gigabytes of, of music drive, and videos. You have to drop a terabyte. <laughs> Something, I don't know. More people have spoken about it. Uh, Nicki Minaj tweeted yeah. about it. And then also Birdman himself tweeted about it. And I, I do believe that Jay-Z is involved in like, who's going to be over like the Super Bowl performances yeah, and stuff like, like that. Right. Some people are speculating that like their past history, you know, Jay-Z, Birdman, Lil Wayne, their past history that, you know, people are like, well, you know, they would have been under the assumption that things had been solved mm -hmm. and fixed. But now that he's not a part of it, the question becomes, why wasn't he a part of it? Because, yeah. you know, once again, I, I get both sides. Some people saying this is a good move for Kendrick because <laughs> mm -hmm. we know he's going to treat the performance with respect and show love to New Orleans and the city as a whole. But at the same time, I do understand why some would feel like, well, hey, you know, it's not what the people want. You know, they in New Orleans, and yeah. it's it's Lil Wayne. He is New Orleans, essentially. I mean, kind of like what they did with a few years ago when the Super Bowl was in L.A. And they, they did the whole little L.A. takeover. They and that, was, that was dope. Like, mm -hmm. that was awesome to have some of the West Coast legends come out there and be a part of that. So it's just one of those things where it's like, I think I get marketing wise mm -hmm. it's, it's one of the hottest songs that's dropped this year so of course people are gonna want to clamber and check it out and Kendrick Lamar does really great performances we've seen him on plenty of award shows mm -hmm. where he just knocks out knocks it out the park with the themes and stuff that he be trying to tell with his performance I'm willing to bet it's gonna be great but at the same time it is that idea of like you know snub little Wayne here when we know you know, that would be a, a, a definitely dope uh, performance for him to be a part of. So. And so when you think about it, look, so just checking this out, the next two Super Bowls, uh, Levi Stadium in Santa Clara, California, Super Bowl 60, and SoFi Stadium in Los Angeles in Super Bowl 61. Damn. Uh, so the next two Super Bowls are going to be in Cali. Oh, okay. Damn. So that's another piece that people were saying, like, man, look, why would y'all put Kendrick on there now when the next couple of them are going to be in, in Cali? Yeah. essentially like LA mm -hmm. like have him do it then yeah it would make sense and marketing wise as well it's gonna be one of the biggest uh, events of course being out of LA of course he could be someone that you know performs at the halftime show give Lil Wayne this one since he's in New Orleans he is New Orleans like we were saying I wouldn't think of anybody else but him no matter how big we feel not like us is Lil Wayne hit harder and of course that's his hometown yeah. so that would have made more sense and then give it back to Kendrick the following year or the year after that I think they're just more so trying to capitalize on the, the recent popularity yeah. of you know Kendrick Lamar and the stuff that he's been involved in this year so I get why timing where we're going to do this but once again you still when you think about it it's New Orleans it's Lil Wayne he's one of, he is like their biggest one of their biggest exports musically yeah. I mean you could have a whole bunch of people uh, you know New Orleans legends be a part of that that's what if I you, did if like you want to like how they showed the culture of LA they should have done that New Orleans I, I think that would be dope to show the culture of you know New Orleans 
on that type of stage. But once again, we don't know the exact logistics, but people yeah, are speaking don't. about it. Nicki Minaj has made several tweets about it. She's still tweeting about it. And Birdman has said something as well. Uh, I believe Lil Wayne's producer was initially the first person to say something about it. He's like, yo, what the fuck? You know what I'm saying? So it's it's causing some type of conversation. And that's how you know he probably feels something. It's, it's something being felt because too many people close to home is speaking up about it. Yeah. You know, normally if it wasn't anything coming from like some of the close sources, you can be like, ah, oh, it's probably something that came down uh -huh. the pipeline of not working and, you know, dates and stuff like that probably weren't going to line up. But if people close to him are speaking out on it, he probably feels like it should be me, bro. How y'all pick anybody else but me? Don't yeah. don't try to capitalize on. And this is going to really capitalize on the downfall of Drake, to mm -hmm. be honest with you. When, you. when you really think about it, it's because they're going to play Not Like Us. Oh, yeah, that's, that's literally the song that... They're gonna be waiting for like yeah, of course. Like as many hits as Kendrick having. We're not trying to downplay his his catalog. That's of course, the song very everyone's gonna want to hear. Because just hearing that at a halftime Super Bowl, bro. Yeah, that's, I think that's gonna put a a huge yeah exclamation on this beef. Like, Even though the song would have been damn near you know many months old, people are gonna yeah. want just the spectacle of it. It's just the look it's, of it, bro. It's just one of the hottest songs Kendrick has ever dropped. Not in the sense of uh, quality wise this is a good song he's had some really really great songs for but sure this is the song for him that a lot of kids growing up in his generation they're gonna be like oh this is one of Kendrick's best songs ever and then to know that was actually performed at a halftime show in the Super Bowl a beef a diss track performed in a Super Bowl is that what we're gonna see it's most likely it's going to happen, bro. You don't have him. If you're going to have Kendrick perform in New Orleans, you got to have him perform the song, right? In the hometown of the guy that you put, pay so much respect to for finding you. Yeah. What, Drake, Drake, gonna, I ain't going to say what Drake got to do, but. I don't know, bro. What can you do to outdo that? You don't have to. Omar! What? Let me tell you something. I can't say one. Go home and get the gun. Go home. Run. Run. I don't know. <laughs> Let us know what you guys think, know, man. man. Uh, we just wanted Jeez. to report on this, man. Just kind of give our little tidbits and what's going on. We know on the rumblings of it. I do feel like they should have gave it to Wayne. Just personal opinion. But hey, at the end of the day, more money to whoever it is out there. Get your bag, Kendrick. I'm not not with yep. the whole logistics behind it. I know if it was Houston and we had a chance to choose from some of the Houston uh, legends and pay respect to the people from you know our our side. I would rather that than anybody else. Mm -hmm. But you know, we got Beyonce, Travis, you know, yeah. we got me, we got, you know, the list goes on and on and on. Slim mm -hmm. Thug, you know what I'm saying? Paul mm -hmm. Wall, you feel me? You can go on for, for days. Yeah. You feel me? UGK. But at the end of the day, New Orleans, I feel like, eh, I don't know, man. It's, that's a touchy thing. Maybe they should start doing a voting system mm -hmm. um, or, or just having some, I don't know what you do to decide things like this. Because then again, you don't, <laughs> I also kind of get you don't want to also make it to where every city has to be yeah, an artist. Course. Of course, of course. I, but, get it, I get it. I get it. But this is Wayne, though. It ain't like yeah. you got to do that to, in every city. Yeah, no, nah, I get it. But, For a fair point. Fair point. So, But yeah, so let us know what you guys think. Mm -hmm. Hopefully, y'all enjoy this. This is your boy Dub. It's your boy Ross. This is In the Clutch, man. Peace. Peace. This bitch is from Houston If she got a problem, then we got the solutions And there's no illusion I made this shit happen, I'm living life lucid I'm switching my strategies Now they hate on me cause I'm causing casualties But why are they after me? Deep inside they know they can't handle half of me